Welcome back, folks. I'm Danny the Dinosaur Jar, and today we're going to do Mosasaurus from Jurassic World. So yeah, let's begin. This is um, going to be a two- or three-part video, and will be very fun, so stay tuned. So I'm going to start by putting in the body. So I've got a few reference images, and this one is going to be um, facing to the right. I'm just a little piece of information, Mosasaurus is my favorite aquatic dinosaur, so this is an exciting video for me. So the, just put that outline in that I've just, that'll be the body, head, tail, and then this one has, a, this is actually from Jurassic World the game, so um, for you, those of you who know what it is. Um, so it's level 40, so it has this sail type thing, and then it's got the um, flippers, and then you can sort of see them on the other side, and there will be the jaw right about there. Now the jaw will be slightly open, but not completely open, so that's the basic gist of the outline. may have done that a little bit quick, but... Um, yeah, let's begin refining it a bit and rendering. It's got that shoulder bone like other dinosaurs do. And the neck is very thick and doesn't look like it even has a neck really, but <clears throat> I'm just gonna the eye is going to be right about there. So then put that in the ridge. That'll be the top jaw. <clears throat> I know a lot of you like Mosasaurus, so I will do an excellent job as best as I can on this dinosaur. So I'm just gonna, I'm not going to enhance the sail too much since people are not really tr well. People don't really know what it looked like, so. Uh, see, the dinosaurs and any artist can approach it with different ways. Like, some people do feathers, even though I'm not a big fan of those. I know some people do that. And then others do very colorful dinosaurs. Others do more grayish, brownish, more dull, dull colored dinosaurs. So, yeah, there's lots of variety. So, then there's the one in Jurassic World, the movie has like these spikes that go up on the tail, so just put those in. And of course the eye has a cavity. It's very much like a dinosaur, but it's underwater. So, and then you can, the reference image I'm using, you can sort of see the flipper going on the other side. So yeah, this is a basic rendering. And now I will, um, so we did pretty good on time, so you guys can just put those in. And I'm going to put stripes for this one, so. Sure to, I don't think I'll color them in, but like I did with the Indominus Rex video, which you guys should check out if you have not already done so. But <laughs> So the nose is on top of it, right about there. And I can put in the, the teeth. I will pen this in, so that should be fun. And you'll see the bottom teeth. Going in like that. I'm pretty sure this is accurate. Because I know the one in the movie was much too large, even though I know it was like 90 feet or something in the movie and the real Mosasaurus is like, I gather it's around like 50 feet long or around there. So I just went to the orthodontist the other day. I got some new rubber bands, like you know those ones that hold your braces t together, like so those that's why I haven't uploaded a video in a few days, just <laughs> my mouth was hurting, so 
I didn't want to talk that much because it would sound kind of weird. So I still have about a year with my braces and then after that my voice will sound probably more clearly when I do further videos. Which I hope to be doing a year from now. Because I really enjoy making these tutorials. And I know you guys like them too, so <laughs> I'll keep on sending them at you. See so yeah, how the stomach is going to be right about there. And there is a neck, it's just harder to see. Now let me just put the eye in a little bit better. It's got kind of a mean look. I'm not drawing mine, it's me, it's the one in the picture. Um, so now I'm just gonna show you guys how to do the stripes. I'm just gonna do regular, or what I call regular di dinosaur stripes, which are just like teeth almost pointing down. And then I will probably cross hatch them in to give them a darker color. Now most of us you can't really see the scales, but there are scales on the dinosaur. Or technically it's not a dinosaur. But hey, I like to call it a dinosaur, so just I just call it an aquatic dinosaur. And then, then there's like this type of pattern. Across the flippers. This flipper looks a little bit weird. Let me fix that up. So I still have to do a T Rex. I haven't done a T Rex yet, so. Though I may save that for my. Don't tell anyone, my 100th subscriber video. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'll probably do a T Rex before then, because I know. You guys probably want one, even though you haven't really told me yet. I want to draw T-Rex anyways. Because when I'm not doing videos, that's the dinosaur I draw by far the most. And then when I am doing videos, I haven't done it yet, so. But I know there's lots of other dinosaur artists out there who draw lots and lots of T-Rexes. So for the um, stripes on the head, I'll actually have them coming up like so. I'm not following a complete, I like to um, sort of make up my own. I, I switched the drawings around and I like to put in my own stripes and decorations on my dinosaurs. Cause then it's more, and you can do that you can even differ from my um, videos, like draw different stripes and do whatever you think is cool. So I think that looks cool because it looks like teeth even though it's the stripes. And the ear will be right about there. Um, the nose will be right about there. And then you can put in some bubbles I'm not going to put that much in, but it does have a few bubbles going up. So you can tell it's underwater. So yeah, the next stage, well, I think we'll, we might do a pen right after this, but I can't guarantee it. I might do a little bit more pencil rendering. I could just do that in this video, so I'll just, you can just darken your stripes in. But I will do that in pen because I don't want to really waste pencil lead. <laughs> Doing it right now. So you guys can just pause the video right now and draw what I've drawn already. Okay, as soon as you pause the video, um, yeah, I think I'll do the pen stage next. So be sure to look up how to draw Mosasaurus from Jurassic World Part 2, which I will have to get out my felt tip pen. And we will begin and in our Mosasaurus. So yeah, I'll see you in the next video. And again, thanks for watching.